guys welcome to my youtube channel i'm dr mrs ekwa ruth the ceo of woody organics international and this is my shop woody organics situated at ontan malingo in moliko boya so today if, um, what i have for you people is treatment for men men those suffering from low sperm count you're suffering from low sperm count you're suffering from um sperm leakage after sex like after sex the sperm your sperm is watery let me just put it watery sperm that after sex the sperm will come out like most men if you go to bed with a, with a woman and where after ejaculation you see all the sperm that have ejaculated will not go inside the woman but it will run down to come back that one now is your sperm is watery, you're suffering from watery sperm. If you're suffering from azospermia, azospermia means no sperm count at all. Like you ejaculate very well, but you're ejaculating by just semen. If they take that semen and go to the lab, there will be no sperm cells inside that semen that you've ejaculated. It means you're suffering from azospermia or we call it um, normal palace, we call it impotence you cannot uh, impregnate a woman you are completely empty you are not a man you don't have any sperm in you you are impotent we call it azospermia so if you're suffering from azospermia you're suffering from um low sperm motility motility that's the, the speed of the sperm the speed it, it, it does not have that force that it will leave your penis to the uh, uh, womb of the woman until or to the uterus until it fetalizes an egg that is sluggish, it's slow, you're suffering from low sperm motility, your sperm does not have speed. If you're suffering from um, sperm morphology, morphology is the shape of the sperm, like the sperm does not have head, it does not have tail, or it does not have legs. We used to, usually we see sperm how it is, it has a big head, it has tail, it has eyes, it has hands. So your sperm can be like it is deformed. Maybe there is no eye, maybe there is no tail, maybe there is no head. That one is low sperm morphology. So everything related to sperm issues, if you are suffering from anything that is related to sperm issues, whether the count is low, the sperm count is low, or it's low motility, low morphology, azospermia, atelospermia, there are so many words. Yes, anything that is related to sperm, if you are suffering from it, just stay tuned and see good treatments. I'll give you two different treatments. Now, if you practice those those two medicines, just give me one month. You come to this my shop and give me whiskey that Madame train because the treatments are effective. They are effective, very very effective, very very lot of testimony. So many people have <coughs> used it. I've prescribed it to so many. After um, their test result, like maybe your test result was very very bad. After taking it. Those are suffering from azospermia, that's no sperm at all. You can take it for like three months. You go to the hospital, you see your test result, your sperm count must have increased until you can impregnate a woman. Yeah. Okay, guys, welcome back. So, what we have here on our table is egg this is raw egg the normal raw egg that we do you, you need to get your two raw egg you get your raw pap this one you don't cook it you are using it like this pap is made from corn for those who don't know pap we, we normally use it for breakfast so you get your pap you get your one tin of milk this is pig milk one tin and you get your honey this is honey, original honey. Don't go and buy that honey that has been mixed with sugar. They are born in mix it with sugar. No, that's not the honey that we want. You will get the original honey that you are sure that the sauce is original. You can get it for me. I say good honey. I say original honey. You can get your original honey for me. So it's your original honey. So for this, um, for the first remedy, I told you that there are two remedies that I'll be giving. For the first remedy, this is what you need. You need, you need your two raw egg, your raw pap, your one tin of milk, and your honey. So you get a bowl. You get a bowl, you get your, your pap. This one can be one tablespoon or two tablespoons. But this, wait, the, this quantity like this is okay. You put it inside your, your bowl. You put it inside your bowl. You take your one tin milk, open it, put it inside. Like use the milk to scatter the pap. 
so that it should, it should be smooth. They should be, it should not be lumpy. There should be no lumps inside. You put your milk. You take your two raw egg, crack it, put it inside, you mix together, you get your honey. You put three tablespoons of honey, you take a tablespoon, you pour one time, two times, three times. You put three tablespoons of honey, you mix everything together and you drink it. Mix everything together and drink. You, this, you do this one but three times a week. It's not every day something. It's twice a week or even twice a week. If your sperm count is not that low, just do it two times a week. But if it is very low or you are suffering from azospermia, there's no sperm count at all. You can do it three times a week. So you do, you make that mixture like that. You take it three times a week for at least two months. Those whose sperm count is not, um, is, is not that's it's not really low. You can do it for one month and you go back to this. You come and give me your testimony. If your sperm count is really low, you do it for two months or even three months for those of you from Azospermia. I said you're taking it two times a week or three times a week, depending on how low your sperm is. Okay, this one now is not daily. Then let me give you the remedy that you'll be doing daily to accompany it with this one. Yeah, this one now you're doing it every day. You get onion, the red onion. This is red onion. Don't want to get the white one. And this one is even small. You get the big onion. Those big fat ones. You get 10 red onion. This onion, 10. Red onion. You cut it into pieces. Just cut it. You put it inside your pot. Don't add any water. Just steam it. Just put it inside the pot like that and steam. Don't boil. I've not said boil. Just steam. I just put it for like two, three minutes. Let it not boil. But let that vapor. Let it just steam. The vapor will just come out from it. Then you pour it inside your blender. You look for honey, original honey. Look for one liter of honey. You pour it inside that blender. Don't add any water. There should be no water. Pour one liter of honey, original honey. You all of us know that you go and get that honey that has sugar. It will instead bring more illness to your body. We all know that. It will instead make it to be ill. You blend it very well. Let it be so. Let it be smooth. Yeah. When it is smooth, now you look for a container and pour it inside. You put the, the honey and the onion inside that container. You close. You keep it inside the fridge. That one you must put it inside a. You must put it inside a fridge so that it should not get bad. So you put it inside the fridge. So you are taking it, you are taking out three tablespoons in the morning, three tablespoons in the evening. Inside the fridge, you can put it inside a bowl like that. Cover, you cover it. You just get up in the morning. You take your tablespoon, one, two, three. You lick it. In the evening, you come there again, one, two, three. You lick it. You lick it until. It's finished until everything that ten onion and that one is finished. While you're looking, you are licking it. You're also doing this one two times a month. This uh, uh, raw egg and uh, milk mixture. You're also doing that twice a month. And this honey and onion, you're taking it um, every day daily. Trust me, guys. Trust me. Within one month, go back and do your test. Go back and do your test. You come and give me this. Come and give me beer. <laughs> Within one month, you come and testify. Yes, you testify. It is effective. It is very, very effective. While taking treatment for low sperm count, just buy banana, carrot anytime. You can just be taking it as a breakfast. You can, or anything in the evening, you can just chew your carrot. You can just buy your banana and eat. Yes, those are the things that help to boost it's the medicine to work effectively. Banana, carrot, and then you can also you can also um, intensify it by doing your grape leaf and carrot uh, um, detox because the detox for low sperm count you want to detoxify your body no something from not just low sperm count any sperm issue watery sperm uh, any sperm issue the detox for uh, for it is grape leaf and carrot okay thank you guys I also have my own year treatment for low sperm count motility and morphology i've already explained what low motility was low morphology was um azospermia was atenospermia i've explained all of that so this one is made with medicinal herbs we all know about medicinal herbs the ones that uh, we plant them in the farm yes this one is made with medicinal 
help it treats low sperm count very very well i am as a sperm yeah, no sperm count at all it treats it very well low motility low morphology everything you take this one this is um the treatment for one month you take this one for one month and you go back for this i have testimonies in my page i have a page in facebook that i run a core with natural health and beauty tips you can go to my facebook page you see so many testimonies for those using this pack those who are using this pack thank you guys for watching thank you guys for buying from Rudy organics thank you guys for liking my page thank you guys for like sharing my page to others um turn on the notification button i'll still um, insist on that because i'm posting new videos every day so you'll be notified when a new video <coughs> come up so thank you guys stay tuned bye love you guys